tell me if you don't recognise the Irish Parliament? Do I fuck recognise the Irish Parliament? Or storm at the shithole? What about the principle of consent? Fuck the principle of consent. Fuck, it's what the Good Friday Agreement's based on. Like right. a Good Friday, fuck up your mean. Just based on the sell out, plain and simple. Fuck simple? Wasn't you up there getting shot or doing the shoot? For my grandfather did the shoot. Your grandfather did the shoot then, for what? What fuck didn't we get a republic? Didn't we get a free state? But what about the north? What about the north? Now listen, how can you say what about the north for fuck's sake? What time are we supposed to be there? Oh, 6 30. What time is it now? Oh, 3 20. Not too bad. I'm gonna scare the shite out of her too. Oh, yeah? Why would you do that? Because we have to use a bit of intimidation, like. No, we don't. Just tie her up, make her father rob the cash, and then we're off. Hang on a second. Hang on, hang on. Are you lost? Because it sounds to me like you're looking for some fucking cartoon lifestyle where we don't hurt people on jobs, am I right? I'm not fucking right. All I'm saying is, if I had my rifle with me back home, I'd have fucking shot every prod I could see. Would you fuck? Your most prods are sound anyways. I'd ride a prod. Man, I'd fucking drink with a prod. Sounds. Isn't that Dave here you're saying that? Oh yeah, why not? Because he was a volunteer. Fuck off. The boss babe. I never knew that. Well, there's a lot of things that you don't know about Dave. Yeah, well I do know he does jobs like this. Yeah, where do you think he learned all that, huh? Tactics, planning, flair in the north. In the fucking north. So when Dave asks you about the principle of consent, I keep me fucking John Lennon, free love, save the world, and all the prod shit to yourself. Do you ever serve it? Who? The Ra. The Ra. You're a fucking amateurs. Superman. Wait, how much 
think we'll make? About 50 grand. 50 grand? I heard this fella's worth millions. Overheads. Overheads? Ah, fucking rip-off, man. Yeah, tell that to the boss. Ah, fuck the boss. Tell him that too. Listen to me now, right? 50 grand's not bad for a morning's work. Yeah, it beats the fucking dole. Normally you see him working with Ruby. But he's not around since he joined and disappeared. So now Dave says work with Paddy. So I'm gonna fucking work with you instead. You know, I told Dave I should have my own crew. You know, about time he fucking gave it to me. <laughs> your own crew? Who the fuck are you to ask for your own crew? So I can't do this low paid donkey fucking work forever. You know? Like me, is it? Well, you like what you're doing, you know, I'm close to that vision. Well, maybe he's building you up for something. Well, yeah, with the simpler fucking ways to make money than this. Oh, yeah? Like what? What about the drugs? Attached to the traffickers. Why, why not run the routes? Why would you ask all the fuckheads out in Abu Ghraib? Fucking smuggling the oil, he never got into that. Look, with the new orders, everyone's got to be the Dalai fucking Lama. All right? I put a fucking fiver in the bank without some cunt asking where you got it. So he taxes the drivers instead, or he does jobs like this. Yeah, it's fucking smart. It's less risk. What risk? Joe, man, we'd be making ten times more cash this time next year. Don't think you're trying to say that you're, you're smarter than Dave. Well, no, hang on. I just don't want to be playing toy soldiers because he's too fucking scared of the ass up. You know what? The end is coming. Do you know what I mean? Time to get paid. You want to get paid? Yeah. Put your time in first. Oh, yeah, like you. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously, Joe, man, if I were you, I think I'd fucking kill myself. What? Why are you so loyal to Dave? What, just because he got here first says I'm the boss? No one's my fucking boss. All right? For me and Dave are like partners. He provides the know-how, I provide the technique. And easy with the fuck Dave talk. Has he tested you yet? Dave. Well, ask me to prove myself. Of course. Did you find it difficult? No. So it never cost you anything personally to be loyal to Dave? No. Well, then he hasn't tested you. <laughs> he can't do shit until he does. About you. Yeah. And that's my fucking business. I think I have a lot of contemporary ideas to offer. <laughs> contemporary ideas. Things we deal in go all the way back to the Stone Age. You know, my young fellas like you, always trying to change things. It's a fucking waste of time. You have a young fella? Yeah. And a daughter. Why are you so surprised? Huh? That a woman would fuck me or she'd have three kids? Both? Yeah, fuck you. 
You must have been young when you had them. Yeah, too young. I'm much older than he is now. Did you bring anything to drink? Yeah. Whiskey. Dave gave it to me. Told me to bring it. Yeah, I was thinking more along the lines of cork or Fanta, not whiskey. Why? I don't drink. What are you, an alky or something? Recovering. Give me a hug then. What? Congratulations. Joe, I am proud. Get of the you. fuck away from what? me. What? 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 How'd you quit? Last time I checked, this wasn't an AA session. Said yourself. Twelve steps this, and how'd you feel about that? I threw the doctor down the stairs, and he hit his head off every one of them. So it was tough to give up, was it? It's like you're a vampire, and you're not allowed to drink blood anymore. Have a whiskey if you want one. I wouldn't feel right. I right, hear. It would be grand. Fuck it, go on. You sure? HIV positive. You know, I had an uncle who was an alky too. Every Irishman's got an uncle that was an alky. Too far sent over. <sighs> too far negative call sign two two cannot hear me over. Too far Roger have it in the truck over. Too far confirm target two two. Do you want me to shoot him now? As in November, Roscoe Whiskey fucking now. Over. Too far, don't you think that's a bit fucking excessive? That's horseshit. It's a messy fucking statement over. Too far, fuck it, whatever. I'll do him after the business. I'm just saying. Too far, Roger. Who's the most fucked up person you've ever killed? What do you mean? 
I mean like a real person. Not just part of a job or whatever. Why do you want to know? Are you working for the company? I'll ask you again. Are you a company man? I'll say it again. No. All these fucking questions. Huh? Fucking asking who I'd kill. It's the question, Joe. Yeah. yeah. Hey! Oh, Christ, you're the doors. So, how many people have you killed? I don't keep count. Hey, you're a fucking liar. Everyone keeps count. It's like the women you've fucked. Everyone knows how many. Roughly. What's this about you being in the hills? Who the fuck do you know I was in the hills? What the fuck were you doing there? Training. Why did you come back? I mean, you're obviously still an amateur. Fuck you. They've needed me in the city to take on more complex jobs like this. Ah, there's nothing complex about this job. If you have the right training. Do they have whores in the hills? I don't fuck whores. You don't do hookers? No. Everyone does hookers. What the fuck is wrong with you? Maybe I just like a woman that belongs to me. Someone pure. Look, I respect that you don't do hookers. Right? It takes a guy with balls to admit that. I wouldn't have admitted it. Right now, I'm just fucking with you, right? I'm seeing what your temper is like. Just need to know that you can handle volatile situations. I've been in volatile situations, Joe. This is not a volatile situation. No, Dave only sends people to the hills to hide out. Yeah, so I was hiding out. That's all there was to it. That's some serious fucking hiding out. Yeah, well, I was with this young one. Her father didn't like it, so he tried to get me sent down. Set you up? Yeah. Oh. He comes in one night, right, with the local guards. They drag her away. Then he just stands there, fucking watching. They fucking, I tell you, man, they fucking kick the fucking shit out of me. He doesn't say a single word. When they're done, they threw me in a cell. So I started getting ready to be disappeared. Fixed now, though, right? Yeah, it's fixed. Sure, I'm here, haven't I? You're fucking blind. Dave. Track me down. A day later, I was in the hills. Tell me something about her. She was pure, man. You know, nothing like the women had had before. Tell me something else. Like what? I don't know. Something that make me want to fuck her. She was beautiful. She was perfect. Like, like proof God exists. And 
Did you ever see her again? I'm gonna find her. Married? No. I got married once. Oh yeah, how was that? Oh, some fucking bitch she was. But I tell you, she fucked me brother. Did she? Yeah, but I caught them in our bed together. Fuck it. What's your brother say? Yeah, he said he had no choice. <laughs> uh, the woman has needs. And I wasn't fulfilling my end of the bargain. Fuck that. I shot my brother right there and then in the fucking head and I buried him out the backyard. Yeah, what happened to your kids? Ah, they're okay. How old? Daughter's 16, son's almost 18. What's your daughter do? Oh, she's a hooker. But I made sure I was her first. I broke her in. Easier that way. I get to decide the clients. Oh. No. <laughs> it should be perfect for a guy like you. I'm going to fuck a dog up with you. <laughs> you take my fuck my own daughter. I don't know, maybe. Well, you're fucking sick. Ah, she stays with her auntie somewhere. I don't get involved. But you still killed your brother and buried him in the garden. You think I joke about something like that? Hello, Zero. This is 2-2. Two, two. Over. Call sign 2-2 two, two and 2 foreign position. Over. Negative. All's quiet. We're hard like iron for this. Over. 2-2. Two, two. Roger that. Out. Oh, I hope there's no carpets or rugs or anything. Rugs? If I put out someone's teeth with pliers. It's more blood than you think. I had to do it recently. Ruined the whole rug. Dave hates when things are messy. They're saying Ruby fucked up. And he let some bitch go to the toilet during a raid and she jumped out the window and got hit by a fucking truck. Where is he now? Fuck only knows. Dancing with Jesus or drinking with the devil? Dave wanted to know where he was, but hey, I'm not his fucking minder. Maybe Dave just disappeared him. But no one's seen Ruby for a month. I miss working with Ruby. We were good together.
said only one. The place is fucking deserted. This is perfect. You can chop him up. Why? Who the fuck's missing him? We got a raid to do. It's all about professional standards, all right? How are you going to learn? You have to chop him. Professional? You chop him. I'm not Muhammad fucking master, shit. Fuck it, I'll do it then. Yeah, I do him in the pool. Messy. Hey, you know what else I'm going to do with my money? What? Horses. Yeah, make some bets with some horses. Last time I was on horses, I had a really good run. Really good run. Horses? They got races here? Yeah, it's the only place you'll see a tank at a racetrack. Did you ever hear them knock a doona, kid? They knock it down, a kid. No. Oh, it was a fucking beauty. The good runner. Fuck. And I had a woman at the time too. Not your wife? No, no. This is a different woman. It's when I was drinking. Yeah. She wanted to save me. So who the fuck would want to save you? Haha, <laughs> yeah, can you believe that? So I didn't care anyway, as long as she'd fucking money. Fuck. Right. Legs always tough. Just have to make sure to get your full weight behind it. What was her name? Marilyn. Her skin. It was pale and always sort of cold, and she had these eyes, like, you know, kryptonite or something. Fucking okay, supergirl, was she? Oh, I bled her dry. But she wanted it, you know. I made her feel good to be fucked over. Where'd you meet her? I asked her for a light. And I was about to ask her for money. What was she? Social worker or something? Jesus, how could anyone fuck a social worker? But you know the best thing about being an addict? Makes you a great liar. Jesus, I filled her full of fucking shit. <laughs> filled her full of shit. She fell for me. So you asked her for a light. She just brought you home. She smelled a drink. She said the booze had killed her father and she couldn't save him and she wanted a second chance at saving someone. <laughs> Fuck, man, she was beautiful. <laughs> Fuck. Professional standards. Fuck up. Clear. So listen, tell me more about the Nakaduna kid. I stole 5,000 from Marilyn to bet on the horse. The race ended. Asked him where did he come. 
Where did he come? He won. Took in a hundred grand. Ask me if I went home. Did you go home? No. I met Gandhi. Oh, the real Gandhi? But how could I meet the real Gandhi? He's fucking dead. This is a little bald fella. He looks like Gandhi, so they call him Gandhi. He had a tip of ten to one, right, from the trainer's mouth. And you put it all on there? Every last cent. The whole place was on it. I was looking at a million. How'd it go? The horse was crazy. It kept kicking and screeching even before the race started. Do you know those gaps that are in the fences? From the ambulances and all that shit. Straight out to one of them it goes. It was only in the race for about 25 seconds. Turned out, Gandhi was working for the bookie. After I won the hundred grand, the bookie wasn't happy. Sent Gandhi in with a false tip for me. And it worked too. Of course, no one told me that Gandhi was Dave's cousin. How'd you find out? Oh, I pulled his fucking teeth out with pliers. <laughs> oh, fuck. And then he told me, like this. I'm Dave cousin, you fucking asshole. What did Dave say? He said I owe Gandhi. I've got to do five jobs to work it up. And I'd to buy Gandhi a new rug. So what, you... You're not getting paid today? No, no, I'm settling things. This job's the last one. And you don't mind not getting paid? Of course I fucking mind. What can you do? I fucked up, you know? I was just saying, you know, if it was me, I'd have killed Gandhi on the spot. You're getting rode. I'm considering your day's partner. Hey, I'll have your fucking teeth out in a minute. So what happened with Marilyn? She used to hold my head over the toilet bowl. I could still smell the perfume on her fingers. Her hair would tickle the back of my neck and I'd be puking blood. After I got sober, things were different. Ask me what she did one time. What she do one time? I'll never tell anyone what she did one time, but it was the most perfect moment of my life. Bring it to me fucking grave. You ever think about that girl? Yeah. Every night. So what else is a guy going to think about all night only his best woman? I love this feeling. What feeling? Waiting for a hostage and she's got no idea what I might do. Get my bowels spinning. How do you feel? Like I'm born for this. That's a fucking good answer. You know, my estimation of you has grown. This goes well, maybe me and you could be partners. Like me and Ruby were. Who knows, it could be perfect. Do you ever think of leaving all this shit behind? Where would I go? Oh, yeah. That's right, sure. All you know is taking orders and getting fucked over by dope bags like Gandhi. Where's your fucking ambition? Ambition? Mm. What the fuck? You're a fucking cunt here from getting to...
That's sent to Dave. You just gotta wait. She's either going unconscious. What the fuck do you expect? She looks like the bitch that fucked Ruby up. Ruby fucked himself up. I swear to God. Just do this fucking properly. I'm not going back to jail. Whatever. My heart won't stop beating. Does that ever happen to you? I've got two words in my head that won't get out. Two words, what are they? That's what they are. Ventricular beats. Ventricular beats? Yeah. It's like this. There's a taxi for amateurs. Two two send over. Yeah, fucking sound. Two two, Roger, fucking not out. I think Daddy is persuaded. <sighs> oh, this is tense. I like tense. Are you excited? <laughs> What's she saying? Fucking haji gibberish. I said you're an animal. Oh, yeah, I'm an animal. Most of all, though. I'm a clown with a gun. And I have you in my snare. Tied up like a fucking rabbit in a trap. So I just need you to shut the fuck up and be my bed, all right? You're a coward. Stop fucking with her. Take a piss, keep an eye on her. you doing here? This wasn't supposed to be you here today. Shut up. This will be okay. Fucking me just to get to my father's money. No, I fucking love you. This wasn't meant to be you. I love me. Paddy, I am tied to a chair with a broken nose. 
Please, you have to let me go before he gets back. We can make a go of it after this. Everyone said don't trust a foreigner. All the soldiers are pigs. But I didn't listen and look at me now. Look where I am. How do you stand there? <laughs> Calm down. Calm down. <laughs> Should have chosen not to miss. Just calm the fuck down. Give me an hour. It'll be over. Shut up. I want you back in my life. I'm not yours to have, Patty. I never was. Just let me go. We leave together today. How can this not be fate or something new? Every night since I lost you, I've been thinking about a moment like this. A chance, an opportunity for the two of us to be like we used to be. Please, Paddy. You have to let me out of here. No, shut up. I can't. This tastes fucking good. What do I fucking drink? The fuck are you doing with the whiskey? Drinking it. What happened to the AA? Ah, uh, here. Fuck the AA. Is she untied? She wanted some water. You gave it to her. She was choking. So let her choke. She's got a nice bedroom too. Found some things up there that made my heart beat even more. Yeah? Drink. Why was your heart beating? Because I could hear you through the floorboard talking to her. Joe, nobody was talking. Ah, yeah, you were. 
Yeah, I heard muffled voices. And beats. Ventricular beats. I fucking love this gun. I've killed 26 people with it. Feels lucky. Easy. 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 What? Ah, fuck. It never goes. What the fuck is wrong with you? Joe, for fuck's sake, will you leave the gun down? Ever since this thing with Ruby, man, I had to chop him up and put him in a suitcase and throw him in the fucking river. You disappeared, Ruby? Yeah, no messing around. Teeth out with a hammer and chisel. Toes and fingers off with a garden shears. Suitcase, river, boom. You ever done teeth? No? How about toes and fingers? You ever done them? It's like fuck. You know, it's your toes and fingers. You did all that to Ruby. That raid was end of story. When that bitch took off out the fucking window, it made a cunt of the whole job. The way I saw it, I had no choice. I was fulfilling my responsibility and I had to teach Ruby a lesson. <laughs> yeah, fucking Ruby. And you respect Dave too much. Just another fuckhead out here trying to turn sand into money. All mechanisms fucked. Every time you spin the barrel, it takes two misfires before it actually fires. All the people they've killed, you know? I fire once. They think, oh, the gun's fucked, I'm free. I fired again. They think, wow, his gun's fucked. Then they get down to business and blow their fucking head off. Do you know what they think then? Well, nothing. They're dead. Watch. Joe! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Off do you masturbate. Now, I'm a twice a day guy when I'm not working. And always on a job. I always wank in a job. Makes me at one with the space. Can you leave the fucking gun down? You hurt this hostage, we don't get any money, Dave will kill the fucking pair of us. Jesus Christ, you're a fucking liability. I suppose it's just an animal thing. I feel like I fucked a house, so I'm not afraid of it anymore. My tension is ease. Kind of like the difference between a girl you've wanted to fuck but haven't. And the girl you've wanted to fuck but have. <laughs> it's easier to be around her when you've fucked her, isn't it? Kind of like you and this girl here. <laughs> well, you fucked her, it's obvious. Yeah, well, you were upstairs. Yeah, Superman fucked her. Will you do me a favor? Will you knock her out? I want to fuck her. Lock her out, I want to fuck her. You touch her, I'll break that whiskey bottle over your head and I'll take your eyes out with the glass. Why do you care so much what happens to her? Joe. It's all about the money. She's the leverage. Christ, what the fuck is your problem? I stepped around her stuff. <clears throat> and I lay back in her bed. And I took in the smell of her hair on the sheets. There was this uh, drawer full of women's shit. And I had this. Tell me, Paddy. Why her? 
You want to shoot someone? You want to shoot me? Shot at. It's her, right? It's the your one with the father and all that shit. Have you got a killer? Joe, listen. It's shattered. I fucking love her. I can't just let her die. I can't just let her die. She knows who we are. It doesn't matter. We're being hurt this off the table. Now listen, there's something fucking wrong going on here. Dad wouldn't want to take a risk like this. Joe, calm down, or I'm going to get mad, right? And this is going to become one of them fucking volatile situations you love so fucking much. You think? You really think? When it comes to some fucking haji cunt who's going to fuck us over, you'll get this fucking killer's block or something, huh? You side with her. Joe, I'm loyal. Loyal? You're not fucking loyal, mate. I'm fucking loyal. I'm 26 fucking dead cunts loyal. Do you know fucking why, huh? I'm loyal because I don't fucking discriminate. I don't fucking choose. I obey. I get up in the morning. And I don't even want to fucking live some day, but this keeps me going. I got a job to do and somebody needs me to fucking do it. I see you talking. Wait, but I don't see you doing the big jobs with Dave doing the big shit, man. Sorry. Sorry. You're fucking babysitting. You're a fucking dog's body. Fuck loyal. This is the woman I love. She's not a fucking job. It's either that or you and her are in it together somehow. What are you doing? What? Like, fucking, I got out of the hills a fucking week ago. This job was planned long before then. How, how the fuck are we in it together? I don't know. I don't fucking know, but you're screwing me. You're screwing fucking her father. You're screwing fucking dead, you're screwing fucking someone. This is a fucking betrayal, isn't it? Huh? This is another fucking betrayal. This, this is not on air of this fucking job. What? What then? Huh? You get laid and I get fucking crucified! Fuck. Joe, stop, right? She's more important to me than this fucking job.
تريد مني Shut the fuck up I'm asking the questions Now you and him still fucking And speak in English you bitch I don't know anything Fucking lion Patty disappeared 10 months ago And I haven't seen or heard from him since Don't believe you I swear I never wanted to see him again Ever You guys are in love, huh? This fucker comedy. I was rid of him. You were rid of him, huh? Paddy almost died for you. Paddy, you loved you. Love. Fuck love. Fuck love. I loved him, all right. I was his princess. I love being paraded around as his trophy. And, and I love the feeling of being drugged or his boots on my stomach to keep me down. I loved it when he choked me every night as he came. I loved it all. Every last second of every minute that I was his captive, his prize. I loved it because I was too afraid to feel anything else but helpless and trapped. Too afraid to use his gun on him whenever he passed out on top of me. Give me the fucking throat. <laughs> Give me the fucking throat! Huh? Does he know you hear them? Fucking test. <laughs> so see how loyal you are. Fuck. 
She's your fucking test. Buddy. Yeah. Do you see how annoying you are? No. You gotta fucking kill her. I know how his mind works, man. Now listen to me, if you don't fucking do her, put us all at risk. Or, you take the hit and you kill someone you care about. It's fucking beautiful. I mean, don't just say, you just got a chance to prove yourself. Joe, I love her. You love her? Well, I got news for you. She fucking hates you. She'd rather let you die than be with you. Now listen, that's how much you know about love. Now look, this is fucking juicy and you can fucking do it. We're gonna film it. Yeah, for damn man, you'd fucking love it. Joe, there's no fucking test. You want your own crew, huh? This is how it fucking works. Joe, okay, right, he puts me in the same room as my best girl. Bitch. Joe, he puts me in the Look same the room as my best camera, girl. He tells me I have to kill her, I'm just supposed to fucking do Look it. Look at the fucking camera! She's the only fucking woman I've ever felt tempted for! Well, she's a fucking woman, man! You fucking use your initiative! It's that simple, is it? Yeah, funny when I fucking toss. It's an instinct. Yeah, what if it was Marilyn over there? Listen to me. I'm sorry, listen to me. I need to kill Marilyn. I had to kill her. Kill her? Yeah. Jesus Christ, Joe. Yeah, fuck, man. You know, she was wrong for me. Hey, what the Jesus Christ, man, you wonder why you're so fucked up? I killed the only person that I ever loved. For Dave. Because I needed to fucking do it. I had to do it. Well, I'm not killing Shadow for Dave, Joe. Listen, I know she's not the fucking test. something die inside me and go cold and turn to fucking stone and I was never so fucking lost this is what we have to do okay yeah, look at me you have to sacrifice you can't ask questions Joe I do ask questions she's not Marilyn right I'm not you Joe Joe Shit. A fucking haji vest is what Dave had to learn in the hills. Who the fuck do you think it's for? Huh? It's for fucking her, it's your fucking test. Okay, 
Listen to me now. I said the best offer. I'm gonna fucking work for you. Right, you're a fucking leader, man. You're gonna go all the fucking way, man. You're gonna take over from Tave. All you have to do is harness that fucking magic. Put it down through your arm, through your wrist, and pull the fucking trigger. Two four send over. What the fuck? Two four. What the fuck happened over? Jesus Christ. Two four targets locked down over. What the fuck is going on? Fucking raid went wrong. Two four. Yeah, we've withdrawn from the target's house. Over. Two four. The Romeo Victor Plan B over. Say again. Before let's fucking debate that later, out. What happened? Whole crew. Poor father, everyone's dead except for Dave. Dead. <laughs> Dave's on his way. Dave's gone, yeah. He's got the cash, he's gonna pick us up, then we get the fuck out of here. How much? I don't think he's had time to fucking count it, Joe. The Haji or Jesse. He's not being followed, right? We need to get out of here. Where's the fucking gear? Where are you going? Where the fuck are you going? Whoa, 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 whoa. We have a fucking outstanding problem here. The fucking witness you used to fuck. Well, I'm not fucking doing her, Joe. You can fucking forget about it. Do it! and his piece of shit fucking world, man, you need to fucking wake up. Forget Dave. Joe. Don't you fucking realize you're killing us fucking both. You're killing us. You're killing us as sure as if you fired that fucking gun.
face. I didn't fucking do it then. You can't fucking do it. I'll fucking do it. Yeah, I'll take one for the fucking team. And you can say you did, you can say you didn't. You'll never be fucking lying. And I'll fucking break your, your fucking neck. All right? All right, you hear that, you fucking cunt? I'll break your fucking neck. <laughs> He wanted it to be a message. A fucking toot! I fucking knew there was fucking something going on. Ah, this is for me, isn't it? Over the fucking tilt. Now do you get it? Hmm? Joe, does that end your lifelong fucking obsession with a cunt that wants you dead over a fucking tilt? Yeah. Oh man, this is pure fucking shame. Yeah. Fucking look around you. This is what your fucking loyalty looks like. Blown all over this fucking country by a cunt who doesn't care if you live or die. And I'm supposed to kill my woman for a guy that fucks you over like that. Hmm? It's the fucking changing of the guard, isn't it? <clears throat> you kill me. It's your ascension to Dave's side. Natural fucking order, right? You're gonna kill me, Paddy. Well, I'm not doing that. It's not gonna fucking happen. What the fuck is wrong with you? What the fuck is wrong with you? I gotta go! I'm not doing it. Do you think I want to be fucking saved? I'm a fucking disgrace! You think I want to fucking live after fucking this, do you? Dave's gonna be dead in ten minutes. As soon as he gets here, I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna slit his fucking throat. I'm gonna take me woman and me money with me. So after today, there'll be no fucking day. I love that fucking man. I fucking love that man. I fucking love that man. I fucking nothing. I fucking nothing. Fuck off. Ed. There's no fucking Marilyn. There's no fucking anybody. The only person I ever fucking loved was Ruby, and I fucking killed him. I watched him die.
The only truth are his green eyes. Green until they went out. your thing, it's not mine. Let it work for you. Would have followed you and the crew. I would have killed any man that fuck with you. And I would have done 20 years if I had to. But I'm not helping to kill the boss, I'm sorry. The day is finished with me, that's it. He's all I had. Let me go out in style. Yeah. Not on my own. On the bed full of dirty sheets on my own, only fucking come. Paddy. You are right not to kill her. I'll let her go, man. There's hope for her if you leave her alone. I'm taking Dave's money. Fuck this country, fuck what anyone thinks. If she's mine, she's staying with me. I wish I was afraid. <laughs> yeah, you're okay, Joe. I love you, Paddy. If you have more time. <laughs> We all pay, Joe. You died because of me. It's time to end it.
was the most perfect moment of my life. And I'll bring it to me fucking grave.
you're going to tell me is you don't recognise the Irish Parliament. Do I fuck recognise the Irish Parliament? Or storm at this shithole. What about the principle of consent? Fuck the principle of consent. It's what the Good Friday Agreement's based on. Like a Good Friday, fuck up your mean. Just based on the sell out, plain and simple. Fuck simple? Wasn't you up there getting shot or doing the shoot? For my grandfather did the shoot. Your grandfather did the shoot then, for what? But fuck, didn't we get a republic? Didn't we get a free state? But what about the north? What about the north? Now listen, how can you say what about the north for fuck's sake? What time are we supposed to be there? Oh, 6 30. What time is it now? About 3 20. Not too bad. I'm gonna scare the shite out of her too. Oh, yeah? Why would you do that? Because we have to use a bit of intimidation, like. No, we don't. Just tie her up, make her father rob the cash, and then we're off. Hang on a second. Hang on, hang on. Are you lost? Because it sounds to me like you're looking for some fucking cartoon lifestyle where we don't hurt people on jobs, am I right? I'm not fucking right. All I'm saying is, if I had my rifle with me back home, I'd have fucking shot every prod I could see. Would you fuck? Your most prods are sound anyways. I'd ride a prod. I'd fucking drink with a prod. Sound? Let Dave hear you saying that. Oh yeah, why not? Because he was a volunteer. Fuck off. The boss Dave? I never knew that. Well, there's a lot of things that you don't know about Dave. Yeah, well I do know he does jobs like this. Yeah, where do you think he learnt all that, huh? Tactics, Flannan, Flair, in the north. In the fucking north. So when Dave asks you about the principle of consent, I keep me fucking John Lennon, free love, save the world, and all the prod shit to yourself. Do you ever serve it? Who? The Ra. The Ra? You're a fucking amateur. Superman.
Wait, how much do you think we'll make? About 50 grand. 50 grand? I heard this fella's worth millions. Overheads. Overheads? Ah. Fucking rip-off, man. Yeah, tell that to the boss. Ah, fuck the boss. Tell him that too. Listen to me now, right? The Tigran's not bad for a morning's work. Yeah, it beats the fucking dole. Normally you see him working with Ruby. But he's not around since he joined and disappeared. So now Dave says work with Paddy. So I'm gonna fucking work with you instead. You know, I told Dave I should have my own crew. You know, about time he fucking gave it to me. Your own crew. Who the fuck are you to ask for your own crew? So I can't do this low paid donkey fucking work forever. You know? Like me, is it? Well, you like what you're doing. You know, I'm close to that vision. Well, maybe he's building you up for something. Well, yeah, with the simpler fucking ways to make money than this. Oh, yeah? Like what? What about the drugs? Attached to the traffickers. Why, why not run the routes? Why would you ask all the fuckheads out in Abu Ghraib? Fucking smuggling the oil, he never got into that. Look, with the new orders, everyone's got to be the Dalai fucking Lama. All right? Can't put a fucking fiver in the bank without some cunt asking where you got it. So he taxes the drivers instead, or he does jobs like this. Yeah, it's fucking smart. It's less risk. What risk? Joe, man, we'd be making ten times more cash this time next year. Don't like you're trying to say that you're, you're smarter than Dave. Well, no, hang on. I just don't want to be playing toy soldiers. Because he's too fucking scared of the hassle. You know what? The end is coming. Do you know what I mean? Time to get paid. You want to get paid? Yeah. Put your time in first. Oh, yeah, like you. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously, Joe, man, if I were you, I think I'd fucking kill myself. What? Why are you so loyal to Dave? What, just because he got here first says I'm the boss? No one's my fucking boss. All right? For me and Dave are like partners. He provides the know-how, I provide the technique. And easy with the fuck Dave talk. Has he tested you yet? Dave. Well, ask me to prove myself. Of course. Did you find it difficult? No. So it never cost you anything personally to be loyal to Dave? No. Well, then he hasn't tested you. <laughs> he can't do shit until he does. About you. Yeah. And that's my fucking business. I think I have a lot of contemporary ideas to offer. <laughs> contemporary ideas. Things we deal in go all the way back to the Stone Age. You know, my young fellas like you, always trying to change things. It's a fucking waste of time. You have a young fella? Yeah. And a daughter. Why are you so surprised? Huh? That a woman would fuck me or she'd have three kids? Both? Yeah, fuck you. 
You must have been young when you had them. Yeah, too young. <laughs> Not much older than he is now. Did you bring anything to drink? Yeah. Whiskey. Dave gave it to me, told me to bring it. Yeah, I was thinking more along the lines of cork or Fanta, not whiskey. Why? I don't drink. What are you, an alkyl? We, we were good together. They said only one. The place is fucking deserted. This is perfect. You can chop him up. Why? Who the fuck's missing him? We got a raid to do. It's all about professional standards, all right? How are you going to learn? You have to chop him. Professional? You chop him. I'm not Muhammad fucking master, shit. Fuck it, I'll do it then. Yeah, I'll do it in the pool. Messy. Hey, you know what else I'm going to do with my money? What? Horses. Yeah, make some bets with some horses. Last time I was on horses, I had a really good run. Really good run. Horses? They got races here? Yeah, it's the only place you'll see a tank at a racetrack. Did you ever hear them knock a doona, kid? They knock it down, a kid. No. Oh, it was a fucking beauty. The good runner. Fuck. And I had a woman at the time too. Not your wife? No, no. This is a different woman. It's when I was drinking. Yeah. She wanted to save me. So who the fuck would want to save you? Haha, <laughs> yeah, can you believe that? So I didn't care anyway, as long as she'd fucking money. Fuck. Right. Legs always tough. Just have to make sure to get your full weight behind it. What was her name? Marilyn. Her skin. 
She was pale and always sort of cold, and she had these eyes, like, you know, kryptonite or something. Fucking okay, uh, super girl, was she? Oh, I bled her dry. <laughs> but she wanted it, you know? I made her feel good to be fucked over. Where'd you meet her? I asked her for a light, and I was about to ask her for money. What was she? Social worker or something? Jesus, how could anyone fuck a social worker? But you know the best thing about being an addict? Makes you a great liar. Jesus, I filled her full of fucking shit. <laughs> filled her full of shit. She fell for me. So you asked her for a light. She just brought you home. She smelled a drink. She said the booze had killed her father and she couldn't save him. And she wanted a second chance at saving someone. Fuck, man, she was beautiful. <laughs> Professional standards. Fuck up. Claire, you've needed me in the city to take on more complex jobs like this. Ah, oh, there's nothing complex about this job, if you've the right training. Do they have whores in the hills? I don't fuck whores. You don't do hookers? No. Everyone does hookers. What the fuck is wrong with you? Maybe I just like a woman that belongs to me. Someone pure. I respect that you don't do hookers. Right? It takes a guy with balls to admit that. I wouldn't have admitted it. And right now I'm just fucking with you, right? I'm seeing what your temper is like. Just need to know that you can handle volatile situations. I've been in volatile situations, Joe. This is not a volatile situation. You know, Dave only sends people to the hills to hide out. Yeah, so I was hiding out. That's all there was to it. Some serious fucking hiding out. Yeah, well, I was with this young one. Her father didn't like it, so he tried to get me sent down. He set you up? Yeah. Oh. He comes in one night, right, with the local guards. They drag her away. Then he just stands there, fucking watching. They fucking, I tell you, man, they fucking kick the fucking shit out of me. He doesn't say a single word. When they're done, they threw me in a cell. So I started getting ready to be disappeared. It's fixed now, though, right? Yeah, it's fixed. Sure, I'm here, haven't I? You're fucking blind. Dave. Track me down. A day later, I was in the hills. Tell me something about her. She was pure, man, you know, nothing like the women had had before. Tell me something else. Like what? I don't know. Something that would make me want to fuck her. She was beautiful. She was perfect. Like, like proof God exists. 
Did you ever see her again? I'm gonna find her. Married? No. I got married once. Oh yeah, how was that? Oh, some fucking bitch she was. But I tell you, she fucked me brother. Did she? Yeah, but I caught them in our bed together. Fuck it. What's your brother say? Yeah, he said he had no choice. Uh, the woman has needs. And I wasn't fulfilling my end of the bargain. Fuck that. I shot my brother right there and then in the fucking head and I buried him out the backyard. Yeah, what happened to your kids? Ah, they're okay. How old? Daughter's 16, son's almost 18. What's your daughter do? Oh, she's a hooker. But I made sure I was her first. I broke her in. Easier that way. I get to decide the clients. Oh. No. <laughs> it should be perfect for a guy like you. I'm going to fucking dog it with you. <laughs> you take my fuck my own daughter. I don't know, maybe. Well, you're fucking sick. Ah, she stays with her auntie somewhere. I don't get involved. But you still killed your brother and buried him in the garden. You think I joke about something like that? Hello, Zero. This is 2-2. Two, two. Over. Call sign 2-2 two, two and 2-4 in position. Over. Negative. All's quiet. We're hard like iron for this. Over. 2-2. Two, two. Roger that. Out. Oh, I hope there's no carpets or rugs or anything. Rugs? If we put out someone's teeth with pliers. It's more blood than you think. I had to do it recently. Ruined the whole rug. Dave hates when things are messy. They're saying Ruby fucked up. And he let some bitch go to the toilet during a raid and she jumped out the window and got hit by a fucking truck. Where is he now? Fuck only knows. Dancing with Jesus or drinking with the devil? Dave wanted to know where he was, but hey, I'm not his fucking minder. Maybe Dave just disappeared him. But no one's seen Ruby for a month. I miss working with Ruby. Don't. Recovering. Give me a hug then. What? Congratulations. Joe, I am proud. Get of the you. fuck away from what? 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 How'd you quit? Last time I checked, this wasn't an AA session. Said yourself. Twelve steps this, and how'd you feel about that? I threw the doctor down the stairs, and he hit his head off every one of them. So it was tough to give up, was it? It's like you're a vampire, and you're not allowed to drink blood anymore. 
Have a whiskey if you want one. I wouldn't feel right. I right, hear. It'll be grand. Fuck it, go on. You sure? HIV positive. You know, I had an uncle was an alky too. Every Irishman's got an uncle that was an alky. Too far sent over. <sighs> too far negative call sign two two cannot hear me over. Too far Roger have it in the truck over. Too far confirm target two two. Do you want me to shoot him now? As in November, Roscoe Whiskey fucking now. Over. Too far, don't you think that's a bit fucking excessive? That's horseshit. It's a messy fucking statement over. Too far, fuck it, whatever. I'll do him after the business. I'm just saying. Too far, Roger. Who's the most fucked up person you've ever killed? What do you mean? I mean like a real person. Not just part of a job or whatever. Why do you want to know? Are you working for the company? No. I'll ask you again. Are you a company man? I'd say it again. No. All these fucking questions. Huh? Fucking asking who I'd kill. It's a question, Joe. Yeah. yeah. Hey! Oh, Christ, you're the doors. So, how many people have you killed? I don't keep count. Hey, you're a fucking liar. Everyone keeps count. It's like the women you've fucked. Everyone knows how many. 
roughly. What's this about you being in the hills? Who the fuck do you know I was in the hills? What the fuck were you doing there? Training. Well, why did you come back? I mean, you're obviously still an amateur. Fuck you. 